everyone, my name is Joseph Paul. I'm the CEO and co-founder at Dam Kononi. Dam Kononi is a Swahili phrase meaning medicines at Chopam. We are a B2B pharmaceutical company focusing on innovation around the pharmaceutical supply chain. Did you know health facility owners spend about six to eight hours in purchase of medicines? As you can see in the picture, these are health facility owners who have been queuing in uh, different wholesale pharmacies. They go from shop to shop, taking quotations, and then finally ordering their medicines. This problem affects more than 25,000 health facilities in the country. You can see in the image below, these are different people in the marketplace trying to get public transport facilities. So imagine if you have a couple of boxes of medicines trying to get into such transport, it will be difficult and this further reduces the quality of medicine. When you're also trying to carry cold chain products, it will often reduce the quality of these products as it is not a secure and safe transport means. We are also on the cause of our business trying to solve a counterfeit medicine issue. Our solution that we come with is a B2B data-driven platform. It's available in Google Play Store and uh, iOS. And together with that, we provide lower cost of medicines, easy payments, and data-driven credit financing. This is our product. You can see we have all categories of different pharmaceutical products. We have special features such as the reorder, whereby it makes it easy for customers to easily sort through thousands of products. Customers can track their products where they are and you can pay for any payment uh, option that you want. We target all customers in the supply chain of pharma, from pharmacies, smaller pharmacies to up to hospitals. And in our country there are 61 million people. And why we chose to start with Tanzania is because they are among the leading importers of pharmaceuticals in Eastern Central Africa, having most of the medicines being imported through the Dar es Salaam port and getting distributed all over. Our vision is to be the largest distribution chain for B2B pharmaceuticals in Tanzania and all the other six countries surrounding it that are landlocked. This includes Zambia, Congo DRC, Rwanda, Burundi, Zimbabwe and Malawi. Our business model is B2B with margins of about 10% and the potential of growing to up to 30% gross and our current customer acquisition cost has gone down to $12 with an $8 billion of total addressable market share. So what makes us special is we recognize that data is gold and we leverage data to improve user experiences and also to improve our internal processes. We have the best delivery time in the market of one to three hours. We have affordable and multiple payments thanks to our payment gateway partners. And we have one of the highest range of products in the market. We have a few competitors as well in the, in the market, having Focus Pharma, Health Entrepreneurs, and a few others in the B2B market space. And we have others such as Maidawa and M Pharma who are located in other East African countries. Our team comprises of 25 full-time employees. Having our full-stack developer, a CTO, he has made the app from the start till end. We have Clemens, he's our chief operational officer. We have Bernard, our certified public accountant. And we have Kilalo, who handles all skills and employments, our HR manager. Our milestone so far, we have 850 active customers transacting in our platform with a total revenue of 315,000 total sales done in 2022, and we are projecting to do $1.2 million this year, having already done 322,000 in the first quarter. We have won a couple of competitions with grants worth 165,000 from last year till date, and our ask is 500,000 USD that is going to be used in salaries, marketing, research and technical development, and core business moderation such as logistics and procurement of medicines. Dom Kononi welcomes potential partners and collaborators to join our mission in creating better healthcare access to health facilities in the African communities. Welcome all and thank you.